today is Ramadan day 20 and well I just came back from school and uh, well Mariam has an extra class today uh, she has a double shift school so she is going to come back about four hours later but as uh, but because today Mariam has judo class uh, like uh, judo is like karate and she will come back an hour later so she will come back before star time today is a very pleasant climate it's windy it, there's a pleasant breeze today it's uh, it's warm but yet it's windy Martin Plata's climate changed very frequently so yesterday was freezing cold it was about 16 to 17 grades uh, Celsius. And today is about uh, 26 uh, grades Celsius. In the morning it was very sunny and now it's getting pretty cloudy. And well, we'll see you in home. So guys, now I came out from school and it's raining outside. So in a while the uh, fast will open so um so we are returning home and uh, it's raining it's less than an hour for iftar so let's go home before the iftar opens assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu dear brothers and sisters i am mariam with my series flowers of heaven my today's topic is Laylatul Qadr. Today is the first odd night of the last 10 days of Ramadan. So in the last 10 days of Ramadan, there is a very special night called Laylatul Qadr. Laylatul Qadr is the night of destiny. Some people call it the night of power too. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told us about this night in Surah Qadr. This night is better than 1000 months. So any good action that you do in this night, it will be multiplied by 1000 months. 1000 months is equal to 83 years. So any good thing you do, it's better than 83 years. In this night, Angels came down and bring all the art. So 1400 years ago, in the night of Qadr, and the angel Jibrail came and revealed the first ayat of Quran. So we should make dua in this night and we should take benefits of these days. So that's all for today. Jazakallahu khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. guys it's time to open our daily ramadan countdown calendar so today as always we have our daily hadith and ramadan reminder and our treats today we also have our famous argentina's bono bon and well now we'll move on to my segment the ramadan reminder Bismillah, alhamdulillah, assalatu wa salamu alayka ya rasulullah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. I am Anahil with my segment, the Ramadan reminder. So today's zikr is, O oh Allah, I seek refuge with you from the torment of the grave. And I seek refuge with you from the torment of the fire. And I seek refuge from you from the trials of life and death. And I seek refuge with you from the evil of the Al-Masid Dajjal. 
So this is a dua for us to make and seek refuge with Allah from all the evil of this dunya and the ahira. The torments mentioned in this zikr are the hellfire, the dajjal, life and death, uh, the punishment of the grave and the evil in life. Uh, so, the, for the people who don't know, the Dajjal is a creature with one eye who has uh, written over his forehead Kafir and is going to appear at the and it's going to appear at the end of times in the Kiyama. And it's going to misguide lots of people and it's going to be killed by Hazrat Isa alayhi salam. The torment of the grave is when the angels come and ask you uh, who is your God, who is your messenger, who is your prophet uh, and what is your deen. And uh, the non-believers, the kafir will respond, I don't know. Uh, what else? The believers will say Allah, Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam, and Islam. And the torment of the hellfire is for all of those who were misguided in this dunya and will unfortunately be destined to go to the punishment of the hellfire. And the torment of life and death are. All the um, all the challenges life gives you, Allah gives you uh, throughout life, uh, maybe economical problems or even uh, I don't know a disease, uh, so that Allah protects you from uh, having those things and helps you to live a peaceful and uh, and welming life. So remember to repeat the zikr. In your daily life, apply this in your daily routine. And Zakalahu Khairan. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. So now, last, we will go to my series, The Hadith of the Day. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh, dear brothers and sisters. I am Maryam with my segment, The Hadith of the Day. So today's Hadith is. The Messenger of Allah, peace and blessings be upon him, said, When the mother of Ramadan begins, the gates of heaven are open and the gates of hell fire are closed and the devils are chained. So this hadith tries to say that in Ramadan, in the month of Ramadan, all the angels are all the angels and the heaven gates are open and the hellfire gates are closed and the devils are chained. So in this month, um, the devils are chained, chained, so we should take benefit from it. So that's all for today. Jazakallah khairah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.